Hi, my name is Alex, and I'm an electrical engineer with Newfoundland and Labrador Hydro. I'm here with Keegan, Ava, and Maya, and we're going to walk through your home to look at electrical safety. Electricity plays an important role in your life. It powers lights, heat, and appliances in your home. Without it, life would be very different. We depend on electricity, but we must also respect it. Electricity can be very dangerous. If you come into contact with electricity, you can be seriously injured or even killed. Power lines near your home can carry hundreds of amps of electricity. Never climb a utility pole or fly a kite near power lines. The voltage from a distribution line is stepped down in a pole transformer so that it's at a low enough voltage to be used by appliances in your home. Electricity is delivered into your home through a service mask. So what are they, all these wires in the wall here? This is your electrical panel. Electricity from the outdoor service mass is delivered to the panel. The electrical system in your home is protected by safety features such as the insulated cables, ground conductor, circuit breakers, and GFCIs. So is it safe to touch? You should never touch the electrical panel. This work can only be done by a qualified electrician. Electricity is delivered from your electrical panel to the outlets on your wall. The only thing that should ever be plugged into your outlet is a power cord. Extension cords should only be used temporarily not as a permanent source of power for your household appliances. Also, frayed and damaged cords can cause electrical shock. Be sure to replace any cords that are frayed or appear to be damaged. Maya, you really have too many plugs plugged in here. You should only ever have two power cords in any outlet. You should only plug in appliances as you need to use them. That's both safe and saves energy. You need to be very safe around water and electricity. If you're touching water, never touch appliances, power cords, or light switches. Some people like to have the radio on in their bathroom, but it's very dangerous to plug anything into the outlets in your bathroom while using the water in the bathtub, shower, or sink. You need to be very careful with electricity around the home as well. If you're using an extension cord outside, make sure the cord is not frayed or broken. Also, the cord should be suited for outdoor application. You should also consider the weather conditions. If it's wet outside, it's not a good idea to use electrical appliance. We don't always see it, but electricity is all around us. By being safe around electricity, you can avoid getting hurt, so stay safe. <laughs>